Hi guys, good morning. I hope you guys are all having an amazing day. I know it's been like forever since I've done a video. Um, I'm just going to show you guys my quick get ready routine that I do, which I've been loving all week because... I don't know, sometimes I'm really into like doing my full eye makeup looks and then other times I am not. So it just kind of is how it is and I figure that this would be the perfect morning because I have to get my house ready uh, for them to come and inspect it today. So I'm kind of in a little bit of a rush anyway. So I figured that it would be a perfect time to do so. Um, I really don't do a lot on days that I'm like, you know, like just kind of rushing around so yeah I'll just get started I'm going to prime my hairs I'm gonna prime my lids real quick I honestly feel like I am getting sick which you know like how you have that like little bit of um like your throat scratchy and all that jazz that's how I feel this morning so it's like I feel like a little bit of congestion in my chest and it's just not making me happy so I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit of splurge cream shadow on my lids it is this really pretty champagne -y color um, I love this because it goes as a really good base for a lot of uh, the palettes that I have um, but it works really good on its own too and it just kind of gives you just a little bit of shimmer to look like you actually like tried a little bit so <laughs> that's why I like to use it and I like it because it dries pretty fast too like whenever you blend it out and I find that it applies best on me like if I'm not just trying to work it into a crease like if I just apply it with my finger I'm wondering if I um, the color is elegant. I love it. So I'm actually going backwards. Usually I do my foundation on quick days, but so. This is Sparge Cream Shadow in Elegant. This is beautiful. I love these. These work very well. Okay, so now that I have that on, I'm going to go ahead and prime my face. Sorry if I do seem a little rushy because today really is a true quick get ready day. But since I hadn't filmed a video in a long time, I wanted to. And I can't believe it is already almost the end of March already. My mom is coming to visit this Sunday. So luckily I don't have anything to like... I never like get my house ready or anything for my mom to come visit because I'm just like yeah I'm kind of a mess so it's just what happens so that was my glorious touch primer and then I'm going to use my mineral touch liquid foundation <laughs> so um, my boys are still like sick right now and like one of them's up eating and he chews so loudly <laughs> he's such a little punk um, I haven't started school yet school starts September depending on where um, I get like I'm already accepted into Michigan but I'm waiting to hear back from Montana so depending on where I go Michigan does start in um, Michigan starts September 4 Alright, yeah, this slight congestion needs to go away. Alright. So that's on, and then I'm going to go in with my Skin Perfecting Concealer right here. Uh, this is a shade lighter. This is in the color Velour. So I don't use very much. And just go under the eye, a little quick blemish right there, blemish there. Sometimes like I don't break out, but then I break out in the most random spots. 
so then I'm going to blend that in. Alright, and then I'm going to go in with my Mineral Touch Press Powder. I have been loving this. I'm really glad that I gave it a try. Um, I usually didn't think it would make that big of a difference, to be honest, but it actually did, so I was really happy. So that's what it looks like, and it has a fun little cover on it. I thought that maybe I could apply it with, like, a brush, but it... I noticed when I applied it with a brush or when I put a brush, it had a lot of kickback, but on the, if you use this little pad thing right here, the kickback isn't, like, it doesn't have any. Alrighty. Now I'm going to do my 3D Fiber Lash Mascara and take a quick breather. I don't know why, like, we always get these random notices on our door that they're going to come and inspect our apartment, like, the next day. And I'm like, that's not enough time for me to clean my house and look like I actually have things in order. Because I think we all know that sometimes we just let our house go and... Or it's like, it's not even that it's dirty, but it's just weird having someone you don't know in your house. I don't know. I don't really like it. You guys have seriously got to see how big my oldest rat has gotten. He's kind of, like, scaring people now. <laughs> when we got him, he was so tiny, and now he's so big. He's actually bigger than his older brother that we had. I think we weighed him last night, and he's only, like... 1.2 pounds, but that ha it has to be more than that because he's kind of a little monster. I love the immediate difference in my lips or lips. Wow, lashes. See, I told you guys I was a little bit distracted. <laughs> And I'm glad I remember, like, last minute, too, that I was supposed to, like, pick up the house before. Because, like, they don't give, like, a time, like, at least, like, when Time Warner or DirecTV comes to your house, they give you, like, an 18-hour window of, like, when they're going to come. I always hated that with cable companies. I never understood. They're like, we'll be there between, like, 8 in the morning and 6 at night. It's like, oh, gee, thanks. You mean, like, the whole day? So I never really saw the point in that. But this one just says we're going to come inspect the apartment what that means I don't know I guess maybe they're just like making sure you don't have like a meth lab in your like closet or something I don't know I know that they like inspected our our balconies and our patios to make sure that there was like no debris or something on it and I'm like um okay so we had to have that done by last month, and I'm like, I think you guys just like going through people's apartments, let's be honest. I keep getting like a big whiff of like my perfume, which is from... Um, like, what's up? Bath and Body Works, and it's like this vanilla rum stuff, and I love it. <laughs> 
Yeah, but I don't want him to look at me and be like, she needs to get her life together. <laughs> it's like, don't judge me. I don't want to be judged when I'm not even around to defend myself. <laughs> How are you liking your mascara, Miss Tiffany? Was it everything you hoped it would be? Because I know that you were away when it came to your house. Alrighty. So there's the mascara going on right there. That is a really nice car. It looks like my husband's car, except it has tinted windows. Hmm. All right, moving on. Where the heck is my other stuff? All right, so then I usually just go on the bottom with, nice, I wanna see a picture. I just go on my bottom lashes with just another plain mascara. I should just leave all my makeup like out here for them to see. <laughs> it's like I don't even care. All right. So then I actually do color in my brows. So I'm going to take my palette one right here, and I'm going to take this color forthright, and I'm going to draw, not, not so much draw as color in my brows. Okay, I'll definitely check it out. I seriously do love this brush though. <laughs> it helps my like wonky brows like actually look somewhat uniform, you know what I mean? Alrighty get my act together okay so then I always take um, this is my Too Faced bronzer right here it's chocolate Soleil it actually smells like chocolate but I recommend not eating it um, they've been really big on like making their products smell like food like I, I was watching a video the other day on um, the new honey and peanut butter or something palette that they released I'm like, what is this, like, obsession with food? Like, the palate, stop it. <laughs> but in all honesty, I haven't tried them out yet, so... I don't know. I hear a lot of things about Too Faced. I've tried their foundation and their highlight, but other than that, I haven't really tried anything. All right, so I'm doing that, and then I'm taking a smaller contour brush and kind of focusing it more right there. And then on the sides of my nose. And once again, when it is just me, it is a lot quicker. <laughs> so I'm probably looking like I'm going really slow this morning. So I'm going to take my seductive blush, blusher, blush, blusher. Honey, quit chewing so loud. I should pull him out and show him to you guys just so you can see him really quick. But I fear that he would scare you guys. <laughs> I 
Alrighty. So then I'm taking highlight, which I'm hoping that I get mine soon, because like I said before, like they, when I ordered my collection, they were on um, back order because they sold out like crazy. So I'm really excited. All right. And then I always use my, let me just make sure I put everything on. Okay. And then I have been using this NYX liquid suede. Uh, my sister-in-law actually sent me a ton of these. I had never tried them until she sent them. And these are pretty sweet. Um, they will come off throughout the day, but not as much as a lot of other like liquid lipsticks that I've used. And this is in the color Sandstorm. So that's why it looks like really close. And they sell these at Ulta. I don't know where else they sell them, but. These are really good to honestly just throw in your purse. I love them. All right, and just going to set, and voila, that is all I do for the quick days, but honestly, I feel like that I love this splurge cream shadow, like it has so many uses. Sometimes I'll take my, I've been putting like my polar blue liner, or polar blue, wow, proper liner, which is a brown shade. And like I'll kind of just lightly put it up here just to kind of define just a little bit of my eye but I won't go like all out with it but I've been loving this this color is really pretty so yeah that is my quick routine hold on real quick let me show you guys my little man over here he's just watching me hold on hi sweetie come here everyone wants to say hi all right, this is my not so little man. Isn't he big? <laughs> he's so sweet. And he's got a little bit of lettuce on his face because he's been eating. So, this is Klaus. So, if you guys ever hear me talking about my little boys, he's not so little. <laughs> and he's my little honey. So, he's such a little docile thing. So, we're going to take off because we have some cleaning to do to get ready for the day. <laughs> Say bye, Klaus. Say bye. <laughs> All right, guys. I will talk to you later. I hope you have a great day. Bye.